Hello, hello everyone. I'm doing this video um, about the Virgin Media Superhub new firmware upgrade, what was released um, about a week ago. Um, I, anybody who's been having problems with the corrupted downloads and you have to keep on downloading a file um, over and over again, well I've had the same issue. I was speaking to um, a Virgin Media support colleague yesterday and um, what he advised to do on the phone is there's basically two options if you're getting corrupted downloads quite a lot um, what you can do is you can log into the um, Superhub uh, with the IP address I will put below in the description and when you're logged in you can click on the middle tab which is Superhub settings scroll all the way down um, and um, set it to modem mode now the IP address will change to access the Superhub which I will also put in the description below um, and then when you're done with your important downloads if it's something you really need then you can switch it back um, after that uh, just using the IP address below uh, the only difference is, is you would have to plug your PC into the first um, Ethernet port which is closest to the network cable now the other way of doing it is when I was facing an issue the other day and I downloaded the file about three times that's when I spoke to the engineer also about this um, I was checking with him if, I, if my router's got the latest firmware which it has, it's R36 hardware version 2.0 now what he advised me to do is reset the modem to factory default um, but he said don't do it anymore by the little button on the back like the little hole you have to use a little pin to get to um, he said the best way of doing it now to completely restore it is and this is how you do it you log into the router with the first IP address which I've put below go to the middle tab which is called Superhub settings scroll all the way down to the very bottom and it will say restore to factory default um, when, while that's doing that your Superhub will automatically search for some new firmware and if available it will automatically install the new firmware also it will completely restore all the settings so unfortunately you have to go through all the settings set up again um, but if you know what you're doing it's easy and, and will only take you a few minutes um, once it's completely restored um, then basically I found out that the downloads work completely fine whatever you download um, it works so that may help you um, it's helped me so far I don't know how long it's going to last for and um, I asked Virgin also if there's a new firmware coming out soon and they said they haven't had any information about that but one thing the colleague did tell me yesterday is a new Superhub is under production at the moment um, and it's and it's going to be completely different to the Superhub we have got now um, it's going to have new features and it's going to be more slick as well if you do need any more help at all no matter what it is put a message in the bottom and I will do my best to get back to you as soon as possible and help you out on the issue thank you